Hello everyone and welcome to a new video and today I'm going to show you how to fix Adobe Media Encoder slow rendering. It's very easy and simple, all you have to do is to follow my steps and before we begin, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and turn on the notifications. Now first thing you should do if you have an Nvidia graphics card in your PC or laptop, what you should do is to simply open your browser then search for Nvidia app and after that you will find here this link or this website just tap on it and here you will have to download the application for your windows just click on download and install it and after that you will have to launch it now here because i have it already i will just try to launch it in front of you right now as you can see after opening it you should now head to drivers on the right side here you have this option game ready driver just click on this arrow then choose studio driver after that, click on download and download the latest update for your graphics card. And this kind of update will help use your graphics card in all creative apps, including media encoder. Now, if you do not actually have an NVIDIA graphics card, you should skip this step. And if you have an AMD card, if you can do the equivalent of what we did right now, go ahead and make it, then open the media encoder. And after that, you'll have to make sure that we have here this option, Mercury Playback Engine GPU Acceleration. And beside it, you'll have CUDA. Once you click on this option, you should now head to Edit, then go to Preferences, then here in the General section, then make sure that you have the same settings that I have right here. And down below, you should also make sure that you have this option, Mercury Playpack Engine GPU Acceleration Coda. Then click on OK. And after that, you should open the panel again, then go to Media right here. And here you will find in this section, Media Cache Database, you will find here this button, Clean. Just click on it, then wait for a few seconds till it do the clean process. Then navigate here back to memory. Then here you should just hold on this number right here. Then drag to the left side and make sure that you have it to the least number. So here in my case, the least number is three. So you have to just click on the number, then drag to the left side to make it to the lowest memory. And if you have the application updated to the latest update, you will find here this option, sync settings. You just have to click on it. Then here in this section, when syncing, choose ask my preference. And after that, you can simply try to do any render on your Adobe Creative apps and your issue will be fixed. And that's all for today. Thanks for watching and see you in a new video.